Hey, how's it going? Well, it's prime big deal days, and I was got off work today and was going through Amazon. Figure I'd show you a couple things that I got and maybe make some shopping easier for you by putting links down below for you. So first off, we got 3D printing filament. This is the Overture stuff. This is what I use. I'm really, really happy with this brand. Uh, in my last video, with uh, actually it hasn't been released yet, but I use this PETG, and I also use this PLA mat. And then in the video I released last Wednesday, or last Monday, excuse me, I used this eSun cleaning filament. This is really a good deal. I'm going to add that to my cart here. Um, so yeah, this is some fantastic filament. I'll put a link to this stuff in the description, save you some time, but I uh, really love it. Uh, so this was the first camera I started using, the EK7000 action camera. A, fantastic. If you scuba dive, want a camera on a budget, not sure if you like to photograph or like to take videos underwater like me. Um, this is a good cheap foray into it. And you know what? I can give my kids this camera and let them loose in the woods, and I know they're not going to break it. So that is definitely speaks uh, volumes about how how good this camera is at such a low price. Um but for my my still shots, this is the one I just bought. So um, seventy one ninety nine on a lightning deal, just a, a fantastic deal for that camera, the the Brave Four. Uh, if you're a snowmobiler up in Minnesota, they have these snowmobile dollies. Um, I'll put a link down to this one. The black one's a little bit cheaper, thirty one dollars. You put your skis up on here. And then you put this under the tracks. You can just wheel it around in your garage. My snowmobile, when I'm not using it, it lives on these things. Uh, you can see I've already purchased this one. But uh, this is just a fantastic deal, and I'm picking up a second set. So here, yep. Yeah, uh, yeah, so here's the second set. So if you don't have a snowmobile lift, uh, this is wonderful for storing the snowmobile in the winter. Um, I have a, the black version of this one, which is not on sale, but I think it's actually a step down from this one. Um, it's great. You just put a ratchet on there where you can use this thing and uh, raise and lower your snowmobile. Wonderful for track maintenance. Perfect for just getting it up off the ground for storage. Um, you can put it on a dolly. They do have a separate dolly kit, I believe, that fits on there so you can wheel it around. So just, uh, just fantastic if you have a snowmobile and you want to do maintenance on it or just store it up off the ground. Here's another lever lift. So you can see I have this one also. So this one you just put behind your snowmobile and you can lift up on it. Now if you have a big, I think, mountain snowmobile, it's not going to lift this up all the way off the ground or lift it all the way up off the ground. So you might have to put it up on blocks. But this is just a great way to get your, uh, get your snowmobile tracks up off the, off the garage floor. And here's a, here's a little bit more premium version of that one. I don't have this one, but uh, I want it. I have this one in black. Uh, this is indispensable for moving the snowmobile around. Uh, you just stick this under the snowmobile. You've probably used these or seen them at snowmobile shops. Uh, once you get your own, you'll never go back. It is so much easier than carrying or lifting or putting on wheels. This thing just manhandles your snowmobile, and you can put it wherever you want. Don't forget, at least up by me, it might start snowing next week. So never too early to get ready for snowmobile season. And this thing is impossible to find during the winter. So it's, uh, you know, get it now. And I, I, it's normally 400. I think I paid 410, 420 for it. So it's a significant, uh, cost reduction here. I put this on here cause I just, uh, bought a third one for my boat. So I took the one out of my truck to use on my boat. turns out my son had the outboard kind of powered on. So when I, between the time I unplugged my boat from the charger the night before and took it out on the water, I had no starter battery. Well, this thing, I've used it in my truck and my wife's minivan quite a few times, and it uh, it works. It even started up my boat, and, uh, you know, just amazing. So uh, this is a fantastic deal. It's normally 100 bucks. You're getting it for $66. Here, you might have seen my video on the, uh, this is in my cart now. You may have seen my video with the uh, Bissell Little Green Machine. I actually had the older version of this one. It lasted me for 11 years. Finally bit the dust. So here we are. We're getting this one. Um, they are just fantastic machines for those little spills. Not necessarily pet messes, but kid messes. Um, cleaning up upholstered dining room chairs after salsa night. Whatever you got, these are fantastic. So if you've been watching my sharpening stones, you'll notice that this one is a 1,000-6,000 grit sharpening stone. It comes with a base uh, and a little ceramic rod here. 
which is, uh, or actually thinks it's an angle guide for your knife. I don't know if I'd use that one. I have another angle guide I recommend that's a lot cheaper. But this is cheaper than the uh, than the WorkSharp system. So if you're looking for a, a base stone of 1,000 and 6,000 grit, this is it right here. Um, I have another couple stones I'll show you here in a second, but uh, really recommend this one. Yeah, if you're looking for a little multi-tool, I just got this for my kids. Just a... Uh, um, my son has it, and now I just got one for my other son. So these are just great little multi-tools. And this one, if you're looking for a, a gift or a stocking stuffer for that, that man in your life, uh, you know, here you go. It is the uh, EDC or GDC Gerber Money Clip with Pocket Knife. Just a great little knife to have around. So I have the older version of this before they switch to the new packaging. And here, these are great for keeping in a camper or throwing in a toolbox. So it's a flush cut saw. They call it a mini folding saw, but for 14 bucks, I picked one up. Uh, I'll probably feature it in another video, but it just folds into the handle so that this thin curved blade doesn't uh, fold on you. You can see it has a cross cut teeth and rip cut teeth. Uh, it doesn't have much set, so you can use it for a flush cut saw. So, you know, if you're a carpenter, you're doing job site work. You know, you can fold this up to protect the blade and toss in your toolbox. Anyway, for 14 bucks, I'm going to give it a shot. It's normally $30, so it's more than 50% off. It's 53% off. So anyway, uh, check that out. I'll let you know how it works. Here, I got this one too added to the cart. This is the uh, it's the uh, Best in Dual Punch Set, Pin Punches. It's pretty much for gunsmithing. You know, if you have an AR or a pistol or even a rifle, it's just a basic pin punch set. Um just got that to just make disassembly a little bit easier. Some of the firearms I've been working on. So just a good deal. I, I noticed for 30 bucks, you're not going to find anything else for 30 bucks like that. Here's the other whetstone I was talking about. Yeah, the other one was a 1,000, 6,000 grit. And this one is a 3,000, 8,000 grit. So you have the 1,000. Then you switch to this one for the 3,000. You go back to the 6,000. Now you got the 8,000. And it has a flattening stone. So this is a wonderful setup for getting that mirror polish on woodworking tools or knives. And here, you can see I've purchased this one. I just got a second set for five bucks or six bucks. Um, you can put this on any stone you want. I, I, You know how I love that WorkSharp 20 degree angle guide? Well, this one, you just it's a 20 degree angle guide. It's got a magnetic base or an anti-skid base. You set it down on your knife and there you go. You got 20 degrees, 25 degrees, 14 and 17. So just uh, just wonderful for putting on, on any whetstone. So those whetstones we had up there before, you can throw that on there, and you basically have the same thing as the WorkSharp system uh, without the fancy base. But yeah, I think this is extremely serviceable. Like you can see, I purchased one a few years ago, been using it for a while, and just got a second one. Then you have the S-Wing tools, made in America. These hammers are made right here in the USA. This dead blow hammer, $30. Uh, that's a little pricey for a dead blow hammer in my book, but this ball peen hammer here and this claw hammer, this is what I like. So I have this hammer, the Sure Strike, 21 ounce, perfect for just general use around the house in the workshop. This handy claw with vinyl grip for 13 bucks. That's just great. If you've got any demo projects before, uh, before winter hits, you're going to tear up that deck. Uh, this is a great tool to have. And just two more things for you. These T-Tracks, so I picked these up. Um... You know, I, I have a workbench and I'm putting, uh, organizing my drill press table or making a drill press table and uh, putting T-Tracks on my workbench just to make clamping work easier. But uh, Rockler sells these and they're considerably more than $15.99 for two 24-inch pieces. Uh, you can cut these just on a regular miter saw. You can cut them with a hacksaw. They're, they're, it's aluminum. They're soft and uh, just a, a great tool to add to the shop. And that's a lightning deal right now, but it looks like it's going on for a while. I'll try to get this video out as quick as I can so you can see these things. Then finally, if you want to get into blacksmithing, I saw this on there. I, I don't know how this could be prime. Can anybody explain to me how they can ship this anvil? What does this thing weigh? Uh, 77 pounds. All right, it doesn't seem too bad. But I'd hate to be the UPS driver pulling up to my house delivering a $655 anvil or $654 anvil. Anyway, if anybody has this anvil, let me know how it works. I, I want to get into metalworking, maybe forge some knives, things like that. Uh, really interesting to me. So I don't know if this is a good starter anvil or not. I think maybe just a hunk of railroad ties or railroad rails is probably sufficient for me. But let me know what you think.
Anyway, I, I, hopefully I covered it all. If you got the Prime Big Deal days, I believe you do have to be Prime in order to take advantage of it. But they have all kinds of Amazon devices available. I have this, um, I have real bad allergies. I'll open this here for you. I have real bad allergies. You can see I've purchased this thing. But it is an air quality monitor. And I'll tell you what, this thing is on. When we had those wildfires from Canada this summer, it was it was reading it. It can tell me when the pollen's going to be there. And it's nice just because I have an air purifier in my bedroom. Because um, we have cats and dogs. But air purifier in my bedroom. And I know when I need to turn this thing on. It, I'll get an alert. And I'm like, okay, now i got to turn on the air purifier. And, uh, you know, I think I did pay... I don't know if I paid 70 bucks for it, but I probably paid 60 bucks for it. So this is a, a wonderful deal for 49 bucks. You can also see, oh, hey, we just reviewed this. I don't think the uh, WorkSharp stuff is on is on sale. Well, let's take a look and see what they got. Yeah, so we showed these, all three of these. Yep, we like those. That is a, a good deal. Here you got a 400, 1,000, 3,000, 8,000. This looks like this is a flattening stone. Um, you know, that might be... A good, you're missing the six thousand you're getting in the other kit, but for twenty five bucks, twenty four bucks, what a good deal! Um, I haven't tried that. Kingstones, of course, I have a ton of Kingstones. We'll have to feature those in a video here soon. But for twenty nine dollars, that's uh, two dollars off. Um, pretty good deal if you're going to get into the Kingstone. This is a thousand six thousand. This is the one I think this is the first one I bought. Either that it was uh, the four hundred. Let's see what else we got here for sharpening. Guides, the sharp pebble, diamond sharpening stone set. I don't like this style of knife sharpener. If this is something you've ever used. I have the, the diamond stones. I love those, but this sort of angled sharpening system, I've never quite gotten into. Uh, here we go. The case replacement for the WorkSharp guided field sharpener. I am going to probably add that to my cart. Um... So I have a case for some of my other sharpeners, but this is great. Oh, here's a Benchmade uh, guided field sharpener. So if you're Benchmade, you want to have a matching set. It is made by WorkSharp. I've seen it before in the store, um, but you're paying that Benchmade premium. They add an extra 30 bucks to the price. Yeah, so anyway, hopefully this helps you. Like I said, I'll, I'll throw a link to all this stuff below. This 3D filament is a killer deal. Eleven eighty nine. so if you just got a 3D printer and you don't want to mess up good filament uh this is very serviceable for 12 bucks a roll for two kilograms or one kilogram that is just a fantastic deal anyway i hope this helped you out uh like i said i was going through amazon anyway getting ready to to save big you still got i think through tomorrow the 11th to um to get any deals so hopefully this helped you uh, if there's anything I missed or something you think I should check out, please leave it in the comments below. Like I said, I'm going to try and do a quick edit, so I apologize in advance if I miss anything, and uh, I'll throw some links down in the description. So, thanks for watching.